Hey everyone and welcome. So looks like Hadi Chopin's body is fully recovered from his Olympia 2020 prep. The Persian wolf has been moving some serious weights as you can see. Hopefully Hadi's visa work will be completed earlier this time so that we can see him challenge Big Ramy for Mr. Olympia title. Eduardo Correa has been enjoying some good off-season training and food. He will return to the stage this year to get another shot at the 212 title. In the entire 212 division, he is one of the most conditioned athletes. Sergio Oliva Jr. is already looking big as a house with months to go for Arnold Classic 2021. With many fresh faces arriving in open bodybuilding, Time is running out for Sergio to cement his legacy. Slowly but surely, Dexter is getting back in his groove in terms of diet and training. The veteran plans to drop almost 30 pounds of muscle in the next couple of months and maintain a lean physique year-round. And two of the best current German bodybuilders, David Hoffman and Tim, training together for 2021 competitive season. It's safe to say both of these amazing athletes haven't hit their prime yet. Hopefully, they will bring their best this year. So there is a mutual consensus among many top IFB pros that Justin and Nick Walker will be the last two men standing at New York Pro 2021. Justin came out on top last year against Nick at Chicago Pro, but Nick is returning with a much bigger and improved package. There was a time when Ahmad Ashkanani was considered the biggest threat to Flex Lewis's 212 crown. Recently, Ashkanani has changed his training style going back to the old school heavy training. The lack of separation in his legs is his biggest weakness and if it's a genetic thing then there are zero chances that he can win that title. Regan Grimes isn't messing around in his off-season. Getting his weight up to 280 and staying relatively lean gives an indication that he is shooting for that top 10 finish at the Olympia 2021. And here is Brian Jones' response to all those who say that his back can't grow. He is definitely one of the biggest and tallest competitors in classic physique right now and he didn't waste any time post Olympia 2020 and got right back into the improvement season. <laughs> Steve Laureus plans to pair up with the legendary bodybuilder Samir to improve his posing. He has been putting extensive off-season work and is 100% motivated to show his real potential at the Olympia 2021. <laughs> Ending this video with Max Charles' update who has been packing some serious size under Milos' guidance. Another great physique whose legs are not on par with his upper body, which is most probably genetic. If you liked the video, please do subscribe the channel. Thank you.